In this video lesson, we are solving the problem from a topic called loss of motion or Newton loss of motion. Let us see what is the problem that we are trying to solve in this problem in this video lesson. The problem is like this: there is a machine gun that has a mass of 20 kilogram. It fires bullets each of mass 35 gram at the rate of four bullets per each minute at the rate of four bullets per each minute now let us uh, simplify a problem by taking it as four bullets per second itself rather than minute let us assume per second itself minute is also okay but let's consider for a second for a simple calculation with the speed of 400 meter per second we need to calculate what force must be applied on the gun to keep it in its original position. So what is happening is when the bullets are moving in a forward direction as an action, the gun moves in backward direction as a reaction. So we are trying to calculate what force must be applied on the gun to overcome this reaction therefore the gun can be in its original position without changing we can say there is no external force acting as external force acting is zero momentum is conserved the meaning of momentum is conserved is the initial momentum of the system equal to the final momentum Initially, both bullet and gun are in the state of rest. Finally, bullet is moving in a forward direction and the gun is moving in a backward direction. That implies we can say momentum of the gun equal to minus momentum of the bullet. Minus indicates that if the bullet moves in a forward direction, the gun recoils in a backward direction. We can write momentum of the gun as mass of the gun and velocity of the gun minus mass of the bullet and velocity of the bullet. But it is given in the problem that it is releasing not a single bullet but certain number of the bullets per second. So to get that into the perspective as gun is firing say for example n bullets per second i will divide the entire equation previous equation with time to get that into the picture so i can write mass of the gun into velocity of the gun by time equal to minus mass of the bullet velocity of the bullet multiplied by it's not one bullet there is a certain number of the bullets that are fired per second per time now i know the mass of the bullet as 35 gram 35 into 10 power minus 3 velocity of the bullet as 400 meter per second given number of the bullets per second is 4 per 1 Mass of the gun into velocity of the gun is mass of the gun into velocity of the gun by time. This is nothing but momentum of the gun by time that is minus if I calculate it is 56 Newton. Anyway, rate of change of momentum or momentum is nothing but gun itself guns force itself so the recoil force with which the gun is moving backward direction is minus 56 newton so to hold the gun back to its original position as the gun is being pushed back we shall apply a force of 56 newton 
in forward direction so that these two forces will balance and the gun will remain in the state of original position itself that's it thank you for watching keep coming back for more and more video lessons thank you